Here we are, get some post-game comments after today's win over Ecclesia by a final score of 85 to 27. Coach, uh, tell us a little bit about the game today. Well, this is the second time we faced Ecclesia. Uh, their coach is doing a, a good job trying to rebuild that program up there, and uh, you know they're going to fight and play hard. And, uh, but for us, you know, we we had a, another solid win. Uh, you know, we're trying to teach our girls to be. Uh, competitive on both ends, play to the level that we need to play at. And I think at times we do a really good job with that, but you know, it's still a uh, continuous work in progress. Corey, you were seven for 13 today, 15 points, eight rebounds. Just kind of talk about the flow of the game and then what you were feeling out there. Um, as for the flow of the game, we just kind of keep it fast paced and play at our normal speed. Um, we kind of started out slow and got in the swing of things, but I like these kind of games. We got the girls in that are new here, they got some experience. I mean, we had some younger girls step up, score quite a few points. Like, we had a freshman score 13, another girl score 11, so it was a good game. Coach, uh, 32 offensive rebounds, only eight turnovers, you forced 44. Talk a little bit about that. Well, when our, you look at our shooting percentage at 17% from the three, uh, 51 from the free throw line, 39 from the field, it gives us many opportunities for offensive rebounds. You know, the, the thing we talk about is competing every possession. Uh, and, and with Corey having a chance uh, last week, she had 14 rebounds. This week, she had eight. Uh, and, and just continue to work on the glass. Uh, but when you're not shooting the ball well, uh, so I'm glad we had a, a high rebounding percentage. I'm just disappointed that our offensive rebounds are so many because we're not finishing like we should. Uh, a lot of three-point shots that we took were good looks. They just, you know, we're we're hitting a stretch right now that we have been shooting it pretty solid, but this was an off night. And um, you guys are getting ready now. Missouri Baptist comes in on Thursday. Both of you comment on that game. Missouri Baptist is a little bit of a new team. Uh, the coaches uh, brought in some, some new players, uh, you know, a little bit on the scouting report. They're better than they were last year. Uh, they're young. Uh, so I think it's going to be a good matchup. Uh, you know, we're battling a couple of injuries right now that would play, you know, a lot of minutes and big roles for our program. Uh, but if we get those kids healthy, I think we're in a great position. We're at home, uh, you know, so we should start shooting the ball better, sleeping in our own beds. and and the goals that we shoot on every day. So that'll be a positive note, but you know, I think they're gonna come in here and give us a good good challenge. Court. I agree, they're always a tough game and a tough competition. It's always a good game between us. Um, and it's always usually pretty close, but I think we're pretty well prepared this year. And like Coach said, with the injuries that we have, um, as long as we can just overcome it, we have some people playing different positions, like I'm a three and I'm playing a five right now sometimes. So as long as we can just get over that and we can get people healthy, it'll be a good game no matter what. Awesome, y'all. Thanks. Congratulations on going 3-0. All right, thanks.